hello and welcome back to the master civil engineering and in this video you will learn that how to find the true bearing of a line in surveying when we know the magnetic bearing of a line and the declination okay i have been given a question which states that a line a b had the magnetic bearing 44 degree 30 minutes in 1910 when the declination was 4 degree 30 minutes uh, westwards we have to determine the magnetic bearing of the same line in 1990 if the annual declination change observed was 6 minutes eastward okay so uh, declination declination is a horizontal angle which the magnetic meridian makes with the true meridian it can be either in the eastward direction or in the westward direction okay annual change in declination in our question is uh, 6 minutes eastward and total change in declination from 1910 to 1990 since there are 80 years between this gap period so it will be 80 into 6 minutes which is 480 minutes eastward okay divided by 60 you will get the angle in degrees so it will be 8 degrees eastward will be the total change in declination but declination in 1910 it was uh, 4 degree 30 minutes westward so declination in 1990 it will be 8 degree eastward minus 4 degree 30 minutes westward so declination in 1990 will be uh, 3 degree 30 minutes eastward okay now as i told you magnetic uh, this declination this is the horizontal angle which the magnetic meridian makes with the true meridian it can be either in the westward direction or in the eastward direction so in 1910 declination was 4 degree 30 minutes westward so magnetic north it will be on the west side of the true north and the angle between true north and magnetic north will be 4 degree 30 minutes okay uh, magnetic bearing in uh, this 1910 this was 44 degree 30 minutes so true bearing okay uh, of a line that is with respect to the true north it will be magnetic bearing minus declination okay so the uh, true bearing of a line it will be uh, since uh, magnetic bearing is with respect to the magnetic north so uh, true bearing of uh, this line it will be uh, bearing magnetic bearing minus this angle which is uh, 4 degree 30 minutes so true bearing of line will be 44 degree 30 minutes minus 4 degree 30 minutes which is equal to 40 degree this is the uh, true bearing of the line okay uh, in 1910 okay now uh, uh, since true bearing of a line this remains uh, constant so in 1990 when the declination is 3 degree 30 minutes but in the eastward direction we have to find the magnetic bearing of the line we know that the true bearing of the line in a uh, true bearing of the line which remains constant this is equal to 40 degree and declination is uh, 3 degree 30 minutes in the eastward direction so the uh, true magnetic bearing of the line this will be equal to true bearing minus declination because here true bearing is equal to magnetic bearing plus declination okay so uh, magnetic bearing of the line in 1990 it will be equal to true bearing minus declination declination is 3 degree 30 minutes so magnetic bearing of the line in 1990 this will be 40 degree minus 3 degree 30 minutes which is equal 36 degree 30 minutes this is the magnetic bearing of the line in 1990 okay you just have to remember that true bearing of the line this remains constant it does not change but the magnetic bearing of a line it changes with the declination okay so to solve these types of question you have to draw a sketch rough sketch showing the true north and the magnetic north and then you have to you know, find the bearings okay i hope this solution video was clear and effective and you definitely learn something new if you still have doubts you can write them in the comment box i will try my best to answer your doubts okay and if if you uh, found this video helpful you can subscribe to my channel share this video with your friends okay thanks for watching and stay tuned